All right, welcome to a tutorial here on Upland. If you're new to Upland, welcome. This is going to be a little bit on easy way to find additional sins. Uh, sins are what you need to go from property to property. Doesn't cost anything to go to your own properties. You can send right here. Click, hit send, confirm, and it brings you to your property, no charge whatsoever. Uh, let's say you're wanting to go to the property right here. It's going to cost you 20 Upix to go. When you hit send, it'll like you verify. The difference in properties will change. Um, plus, it costs you a send. Now, to get sends, what you need to do for the easiest way is, well, first of all, have a mesh of properties around when you're trying to hunt. That's mostly what you want your sends for. But if you come here into upxland.me, you can go to find by send. You put in your name of your icon, hit search. It's going to pull all the ones that are close to your property and the distance away that they are. So right here, this one is 106 meters from this property. When you click it, you can see it automatically copies it, puts it in your clipboard. So you go to Upland, you hit your little search icon down here, Control V, or you can right, left, right click and hit paste. It puts in your address. And when you go here, if you zoom out a little bit, you should see this plane very close. I hit send. Doesn't cost me anything to send there. I press the little icon button here in the bottom left hand corner. It brings you in a little quicker. Now this is close enough that you should be able to, but it's out of range. But you'll see that it's going in that direction already. So you just have to wait a minute. Once it gets a little closer, you'll be able to get it. Now there's a key to sins. Um, you're only allowed to collect 25 paper airplanes a day. That's not total sins, it's just the airplanes. You'll see once it gets closer, if I try to, my limit has been reached. I cannot collect any more for the day. So my treasure hunting is done until tomorrow. Uh, but using this helps instead of trying to find all the areas or jumping around your properties by scrolling out and clicking over here and going, is there any around me? Which there is. But a lot of times you'll get to some of your properties and you look in and there's nothing around. Um, another trick when going to your properties, we'll go back to this one. We know there's one there. We're going to go ahead and send. Hit our little icon button in the corner. Gets us there quicker. And our plane is to the right. As you can see, our avatar is going down left. So if you zoom in real close and you find the sweet spot, which is about right there, and you click, you can just hit send, confirm. And if you zoom in and you get it set where you can, let's see, where you can hit it just right. Got to zoom in some more, and you'll see immediately that it's not going in the direction that you want it. So we need to go a little bit to the right. You can keep clicking, and 
try to get it to go in the direction you need it to go. And we're in that sweet spot right now. So all we got to do is not move our mouse. Notice it's not going right. And you can keep doing this and try to force your avatar to go in the direction you need it, which we need it to go right. You can you can keep sending as many times as you want. So as you can see, it's now going in the the direction that we would need to get it to go towards our airplane. And then you wait till it gets over there and then you collect it. Um, this is the easiest way to try to get your sins that you'll need to uh, treasure hunt, mint properties, to go anywhere in the game that you're trying to go to, go to the airport, the bus station, to go in between cities. Um, I will make another video um, about treasure hunting once I have some more sins, and that'll be the next one in the series. If you're new to Upland, you haven't joined yet, or if you'd like to, click my link down below for your bonus. Um, happy hunting, happy gathering properties.